Good evening, world. I said good evening because it's night time, and I'm gonna show you guys an utada and utada and utada. Okay, so I'm just wearing this cardigan. Where this from? Oh, this one is from American Apparel. Yeah, American Apparel. I think I put it in my Black Friday haul before. Um, yeah, American Apparel, and then my shirt says, don't go too far, stay who you are, and I got this from Brandy Melville, and so are my shorts, but my shirt is so long that I think people thought today that I didn't have pants on. I know ho. So it is currently 9 p.m., and we started our vlog late because we just felt like it. We went to Ranch 99, which is a Chinese-owned grocery market. Hello, Michi. And I don't know, we just bought a lot of stuff, but one thing I did want to show you guys is this right here. Oh, my alarm is going off. Um, is this cutting board right here because I recently posted a video on my fitness routine on my channel and I was showing you guys how I was cutting my meats and stuff and someone said that it's actually very um, dirty to have a wood cutting board because the bacteria stays in there. So thanks for letting me know. So I went out and picked up a plastic one and this one is kind of sturdy looking you know it's plastic up here but the bottom of it is wood so I guess you can use either side but I'm most likely gonna use this side but I just didn't want a very thin plastic board just because I feel like I'm gonna break it so yeah thanks for the suggestion hi guys do you guys want to hear me fart yeah okay Wah has this trick where he he squeezes his butt cheeks against the wall this one's kind of like okay hold on everybody he's gonna take off <laughs> I think I ripped something. <laughs> um, if we didn't rip, it turned brown. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it doesn't stink. Yeah. Oh, dang it, I can't do it. Babe, you do it. Okay. So we're about to have dinner now. Let me just show you what we're eating. We are having rice Wa and I are switching over to eat brown rice now just because it's healthier and we actually really like the taste of it and Wa made this beef stew he cooked it for a few hours already it's just beef stew with carrots and vegetables and more vegetables and then just a little bit of lean pork wow babe you're so Asian for this <laughs> this is vintage <laughs> <laughs> trying to keep this clean, huh? I'm just trying to keep it nice and vintage. Nay, the Yamo Pin, why Taiwan Yi, the cat's up, eh? Come, man, when you see Jamaica, Jamaica. I only know in English is glitter. Spoon. Oh. Now I'm just having the soup that I made. It's just um, squash. No, it's like a Chinese squash, and I added a few pieces of pork in there just for a little flavor and boiled it. Pretty healthy, pretty healthy. So we decided to try something new today. Why the fuck is this still here? Hold on. So we decided to try something new today. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this is, you know, usual what I get. You guys should know. Um, but I never got this before. This is, uh, what is this? Popping boba? Some pomegranate flavored popping boba. If it's even focused on it. Yeah. And then Whaley just got a regular milk tea. Green milk tea, you know? Or is it just regular milk tea? Yeah, green milk tea. Oh, she said it wasn't that good. But yeah, it's called uh, Boba Loca. Good morning, world. So, I'm going to tell you something gross, okay? So, have you guys ever shaved? You know, while you're shaving the bikini area, you kind of, you know, work your way back. Because sometimes, okay? Sometimes you get that random hair that's growing, like, you know, near the butthole, okay? So, earlier, I was sticking my razor back there, you know, trying to, like, shave that little piece of hair that I felt. And then... Little did I know that I cut my butt. So earlier when I, t um, when I went to take a poop, and then when I was wiping my butt, it was like bleeding, and I was like, what? And then um, it just started stinging, you know, and it's been about, I would say, 10 minutes, and it's still stinging. It was kind of weird seeing that I had a bloody butt. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I know you guys have seen this in the background of our videos, and this, my friend, is my makeup area because... As you can see, my, oh my god, my room is so messy. It's embarrassing, but there is no space in here for a table. Well, I mean, I guess I could put it here, but then it really, you know, makes this walkway really short. So, yeah, I just don't have space for a makeup table. So, I just have my makeup on the floor. 
and I don't know I might be moving out of this apartment when my lease is up so I don't want to buy too much furniture since I signed a very short lease um, but yeah if you guys ever see this in the background of my of our vlogs don't think that I'm a very messy person well I mean clearly you can but it's because I don't have a table so as you guys probably noticed, I don't have my eyebrows did yet because I'm filming my eyebrow tutorial today and I should probably get to it because it's already like 3 p.m. right now and normally to film a video it takes me, well since today I'm doing an eyebrow video it will be a little easier to film so I'll probably film for I would say three hours and then editing I have like this really cute idea in mind so I'm probably going to end up crying tonight when I'm editing because I'll be up till like, like 3 a.m. or something. I say this because if you ask why, it's so embarrassing, but every time I edit till like maybe 3 in the morning, I get so tired and like I, I don't know why I get really emotional because I feel so tired and I feel like the video was not how I wanted it or whatever and I just, I like get disappointed in myself and I end up crying and I should probably get to filming right now so that doesn't happen tonight. Right babe? Yeah. <laughs> and he, every time I start crying, I wake him up I'm like, I'm so frustrated and he'll, he'll wake up and he'll comfort me and then the next day we laugh about it <laughs> I'll wake up really clueless <laughs> I just woke up, what the fuck are you crying? <laughs> <laughs> I know, every time after I cry I'm like, why the fuck? So I'm just watching It's Judy's Life and tomorrow, actually no, today is the day. She uploaded this yesterday and she should be having her twins today. So congrats, Judy. And let me pause this real quick. Look at Michi. What did I say about sleeping in this small bed? Why are you always in this small bed? See, okay, that huge bed, this bed is for Michi, you know, the bigger one. And she just likes to sleep on the little one. But I think it's just because Shiba Inus are very cat-like. So that's why she likes to curl up and snuggle up like a little cat. Like a little cat. Who's like a little cat? You're like a little cat. Where's daddy? Where's our papa? While I went to the gym. While I was filming. Filming actually took way longer than I expected. But here was my little setup. I wanted to use a white wall so... There's my white wall and all my brow stuff because, like I said, I was doing a brow video and camera's on the floor. Shouldn't be on the floor, but oh well. And look at this. Homemade. Well, I just put like a Sephora bag behind this light because um, it's just by itself and has no support. So he's like leaning it on that bag. And yeah, this is like my little filming setup-ish thing. This is like a light box. You can't even see it. But um, yeah, this light box right here and then this ring light that freaking broke. This is the same one that Judy uses, and I had it for about, I don't know, four months, and it freaking broke already. Or it's probably just because I'm... Actually, no, I wasn't even super rough with this light. What the hell? It broke. So I just had to rest it on something to make it work. But yeah, I'm so breathless. Go stack Back your to boxes. watching Judy. And I'm guessing this is how you guys feel. Like, I know a lot of you actually look forward to our vlogs and you really enjoy them. And for me, it's like Judy's videos. Judy's and Bub's videos. I'm always watching them and I wait for them every day. <laughs> what is he doing? He just washed his shoe and he's trying to dry it. <laughs> he looks so stupid. See how he reacts when he comes in. Oh, he's gonna do it again. <laughs> he saw me. <laughs> Just looks so stupid. <laughs> oh. <laughs> So we're about to make dinner and let me show you guys. So we're gonna make some chicken thigh with some green onion and bell peppers or mini sweet bell peppers. And then this is, what is this called? Chinese broccoli, right? Yeah. I don't know, like with Chinese. Choi sum. Choi sum, I don't know. Then there's kin choi. It's like that. It's like that. Oh, or it's like a lap chow. So while I went to this like market, I guess. And look at these little apples. They're the size of my... Boops. <laughs> Small boops. Small apples. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, I got five of them for like um, less than a dollar. They're I think. so little. Maybe one dollar for all five of them. 
等于这。哇哦 ！Can you close the fridge? <laughs> This girl is looking at bags again. <laughs> Not again. It's almost my birthday. <laughs> Can we see it? This is really cute. Oh, we have Michi over here too. We are at Nordstrom. No, we're at Neiman Marcus. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Neiman Marcus. It's really cute. I like it. I like it too. <laughs> Does Michi like it? Michi, do you like it? She's saying no. So we're back at the car, and I didn't get the bag, of course, because. You should never do impulsive buys, okay? Especially when it comes to anything expensive. Learned my lesson because every time you see something and then you like it right away, you're gonna tell yourself, "Oh my god, I have to have, I have to buy it." But then you need to go home, and then after you go home, if you continue to think about it and you really just can't be without it, then that's when you know you're supposed to get it. Okay? What kind of stupid logic is that? I don't know, but it works for me. Okay? Because every time I want to buy something, I always think about it like really hard. Like, okay, can I just stop thinking about this bag or like shoe? Well, actually, in my case, it's. Oh, tell people here. In my case, it's never shoes. I normally just like to get bags. But I haven't gotten a bag in a while, and for me, normally I don't like to buy anything expensive unless there's like an occasion for it. So I. I would say only on my birthday, and if I don't get something nice for myself on my birthday, I would normally get it on Christmas. But I never buy expensive things, like on impulse or um, what's that word? <laughs> like I never buy expensive things often. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Once in a while, I think that girls should spoil themselves, even though that sounds kind of bad. But I think it it's reasonable. When it's your birthday, it's almost my birthday. Okay, we're having dinner now. Brown rice as usual, and we're just having a pretty healthy dinner tonight. We're having lots of vegetables, so a plate of vegetable here, just chicken with a little bit of seasoning and soy sauce, and fish. What kind of fish is this, babe? Swai, swai fillet, swai swai, <laughs> and yeah, Wa of course has his. Tapasio. Just kidding. Tapatio. And of course, we can't eat without watching our Chinese drama. So, like I predicted this morning, I will be editing all night, which I'm actually fine with. I am not super tired, so that's good. Anyway, it's 11 p.m. right now, and I am supposed to be editing, but I am watching what's in my bag videos. I watched a lot already, and right now I'm. Claire's. I just started the video. I uh, haven't really got really into it yet. But yeah, I'm just watching what's in my bag videos, which I really shouldn't be. But hey. Okay, the reason why I'm watching what's in my bag videos is because um, earlier when I saw that YSL bag, I just, I keep thinking about it. I keep wanting to get it. But I want to make sure that I make a good decision. So I'm just looking at other tag videos just to see um, what kind of bags like people are reviewing and stuff like that. I just want to, you know, have a clear view of what I want to purchase. So um, I've just been seeing a lot of Celine bags. I saw Hart's video, I saw Ingrid's video, and a lot of people have the Celine bag. I've thought about that bag before, but I just don't like how heavy it is. It's really, really heavy, and I want a bag that's very light. Um, so yeah, anyway, I'm just slacking off right now. I don't want to edit because my brain is getting fried. I'll give you guys a little sneak peek of what I have so far. Or actually, I'm not going to give you guys a real sneak peek, but I just want to show you guys who's blowing up my phone. Um, not really going to tell you guys how I edit since it's kind of really complicated. But yeah, can you guys see all these little things you add to the video? That's for those little effects or like when you guys see words popping up or like little bubbles and stuff flying around. That's what these little things are. Um, so yeah, do you guys want to see a sneak peek? Here, let me show you. That's all you're gonna get. <laughs> but by the time you see this video, I mean it's gonna be up already. But oh, sometimes 
you when you're editing you listen to the same song over and over again you replay the same clip over and over again trying to edit every little bit and piece of it and you just go crazy well at least i go crazy i mean come on now any of you beauty gurus out there can agree with me like doesn't it drive you nuts like you're watching the same clip over and over again you're listening to the same song over and over again and before you edit this video you've already played that song over and over again in your head just so you can get like in the mood of the the video for filming purposes and it's like god not complaining though i actually really do enjoy it but um that's why i'm just taking a little break and watching videos and stuff like that because my brain is about to get fried and i am just gonna paint my nails actually i just got a pedicure i mean manicure yesterday and i am not going to paint them but i'm gonna put this top coat over it just because i saw it in a magazine and it's basically this is the sally hansen triple shine and it basically is a nail polish top coat nail polish that um keep, how do i word this it's basically a nail polish that protects your nail to shine that makes no sense what am i talking about okay it's basically a nail polish that keeps your nails shiny throughout like anything so yeah i'll see how it works i guess and i'll let you guys know if you guys are curious it's 12 17 a.m right now still editing or actually not really editing Anyway, I just finished FaceTiming um, Sophie. She's in Korea right now because she's visiting her grandpa. And um, yeah, we were just FaceTiming for a little bit, but connection was so bad that we just decided to text. And then we were just talking about Judy, how Judy is due today. And it reminded me to check Judy's Facebook. And I've been refreshing her page for like the past 30 minutes and no updates. Um, let's see. Um, the last update says that they're watching prestige and contractions are getting stronger so um i'm assuming that means um her babies are going to come soon like by tomorrow i'm so excited i can't wait to see and um yeah at the same time it got me a little scared okay because i was watching her vlog that she just posted tonight and um she was just talking about you know babies and stuff and just seeing how her body changes and how big your belly gets from being pregnant that that's just crazy to think that a woman's body is capable of that and I don't know I feel like being able to have children is such a brave thing because you know having kids is not like buying something it's a commitment for life I mean duh but I don't think a lot of people actually think about it into like don't don't think deeply about it like you really have to be ready to have a kid you know mentally financially and just what it's so crazy i can't believe that you know i've watched judy for so many years and now she's having twins and she had juliana already and it just amazes me how life really goes by so fast like next thing you know you guys i'm gonna be pregnant oh wait hold on hold on <laughs> okay i'm not getting pregnant any, anytime soon but you know one day if youtube is still existent like 10 years from now you guys you guys are gonna watch me have babies like is that fucking crazy or what okay like you guys have seen me since i was 15 years old with my sperm looking eyebrows and my ghetto ass okay i'm still ghetto but but really, one day, I'm going to be a very mature woman. I mean, well, more mature than now, you know. But, wow, I'm really going to have kids one day. And you guys are hopefully going to see this. Hopefully, YouTube still exists. Hopefully, I'm still doing YouTube videos. And one day, I'm going to look back and be like, wow, I'm giving birth. By the way, I'm not really impressed with this top coat. Um, it took forever to dry and now there's like creases in my nails and well that's because i wasn't really careful but i had no idea it would take so long to dry it's been about an hour and i accidentally bumped my hand just now and look at that little dent in there no that's not little actually that's a huge dent and yeah it, i just didn't think it would take this long to dry that's kind of annoying i don't like when nail polishes take forever to dry Ugh. but i mean and plus I don't know the formula was a little hard to apply it was kind of streaky but anyway just my thoughts <laughs> fuck you <laughs> that's not like you're mad
dramatic. Babe, this is like a once-in-a-lifetime thing. I took advantage. Yeah, it better be once-in-a-lifetime. <laughs> we actually have a 